What's up guys, it's your girl Shay Unique and I'm back with another video, you feel me? Okay, so today's video is going to be how I um, define my curls. Um, I've been natural for about three to four years and I've cut my hair, I've grown it, I've cut it and I've grown it. And now I'm finally growing it out to see how long that I can grow it. Um, at first I was doing sewings to help grow it but I realized that it was breaking off my hair a lot and my hair started to, started to break off and get really thin and dry and brittle. Um, so I stopped I stopped putting sew-ins in. I mean I did one sew-in one time and I had it in for like a month, a month or two months, I don't remember but um, it grew really long from that. Um, but you know when I did did a sewing again another time it just it just wasn't healthy for my hair so what I started to do is make wigs and I braided my hair underneath and it's really been growing and I bought this oil it's called wild growth let me get it I bought this oil to help you know my hair get thick again because I have very fragile hair um, and my hair is really thin and so I you know, and I wanted to see how long my hair can grow. So I wanted to get something that would help my hair grow a little faster um, while taking care of my hair and moisturizing it and keeping it trimmed and washing it when I when I need to. So I bought this um, hair oil. It's called Wild Growth. And it's a light oil moisturizer. And it looks like this. I know everybody has talked about this. I know people have heard about it. Um, yeah so basically you're only supposed to use a few drops on your scalp um and you know uh, rub it throughout your hair I and mean, so far it's been working pretty well the only thing that i can say about it is that i feel like it makes my scalp a little bit itchy because it's so strong so that's why they tell you not to put too much on just a few drops throughout the whole head um because it's really strong um just the smell the smell is not that bad, but it is pretty strong. So if you put a lot, it's it's gonna be really strong. Like it's almost it's almost smells like tea tree oil. So yeah, it's not bad. It, it works for my hair. I've noticed a change. I noticed my hair has been a little bit thicker. Um, but yeah, it's been a lot thicker and it's growing pretty fast. Because I just trimmed my head and it's already growing and I've noticed noticed my when I put my hair in ponytails and I have it in like puff balls, my puffs are getting much bigger and thicker and fuller. So that's that. My hair is freshly washed. I just washed it. This is what it looks like when it's washed. It's not the curls are not defined. My hair is basically um kinky curly. Um I would consider myself maybe a 4b c it's kind of like in the middle of b and c um so yeah and i washed it with these products this brand i don't know how to say it but i think it's ite natural hair products and i used the the caramel um treatment i don't feel like going to get it so yeah, I used the caramel treatment. I let that sit for about 20 minutes um, under under a cap or with a cap over it. And then I shampooed it with this. And then I put the silk protein um, conditioner on it. Um, and I leave that on for just a little bit, like five minutes. And then I detangle it with my fingers. And then while the conditioner is in there, I normally spray this. It's called Nutrient and it helps with like dandruff and itchy scalp because I have very itchy scalp and I I don't have dandruff but my scalp gets flaky because my it's just like my hair eats up oil but my hair gets dry really fast so yeah so for today's video we're going to be using the brand Eden Body Works now I've never heard of this 
but I saw like one video, like literally one video because I haven't researched it because I didn't know anything about it. But I researched it and I've seen people use it and I've heard really good, a really good review from the one video that I saw. So um, I just decided, I decided to try it. I saw it in Walmart, so I decided to get it. You can get it at Walmart, Target, uh, any drugstore you can get it from or any beauty supply store. Um, and it looks like this. Eden Body Works Natural Cleansing Co-Wash. I got the co-wash and it says cleansing condition. And then I got the natural pudding soap. I don't know how to pronounce it, but yeah. And this is to moisturize it. So I'm not going to use the co-wash today, obviously, because I already washed my hair. And then I also got the leave-in conditioner. And it's paraben free and sulfate free. All of these products are paraben free and sulfate free. So what I'm gonna do is gonna put this leave-in conditioner first. Then I'm going to use the natural pudding. And then I'm gonna apply my um, eco styling gel. Let me go get that. And this one here, of course, my eco styling gel. And I'm gonna run my fingers through my hair and that's how I get my hair defined. So if you would like to know how I get my curls defined, then stay tuned. Can too. Um, the shea butter joint can can too. I feel like I have to put a lot of gel for my curls to be defined. Like, but with the can too, it works fine for me. So, um, I don't know about these products yet. What made you get down? Huh? What made you get down? Well, because I wanted, I needed to find something that works 
from my hair because I feel like the can too will just make my hair dry out. I mean, this is not bad. Look. Is it? Yeah. Okay.
Okay guys, so here is the finished look. As you can see. my thoughts on the Eden Eden Body Works I felt like it was too watery versus like I don't know it just wasn't it wasn't that thick which is it can be a good thing and a bad thing um I just felt like I needed to put a lot of product in order to get like my curls to get defined um and I had to put like a lot more gel than I normally do because the, the product didn't really do. But I guess this is basically just to moisturize. It's not really to help define your curls. Um, but it did make my hair really soft. Um, but overall, it's not that bad. It got the job done. Um, I wouldn't use it again to define, try to define my curls, but to moisturize my hair or to do um, like a twist out, I would use this instead of like doing a wash and go with it. But overall, it didn't come out that bad. Like as you can see, the curls on this side is a little bit more defined. You can kind of see, and definitely in the back. I don't know if like up here I put way too much product than I did back here, but back here is not as defined as the foot. I don't know, I have different textures, like in the front it's like more loose, uh, like a loose way like this. And then in the back, my hair is more kinky and it curls like a spiral. Like. And then in the middle it's just... It's like a mixture of spiral and wavy, like literally. So, I mean, overall, this is what it looks like. Not bad. But, but yeah, thanks for watching. I hope you guys like this video, and see you in my next one. Bye.